The Timbers Army has been lined up since last night in anxious anticipation of today's Cascadia Cup clash. The Seattle faithful have made the trip from the Emerald City and arrived in numbers to support the Sounders. An incredible atmosphere on a beautiful evening in Portland. First place in the Western Conference is on the line next. All by Siggy Schmidt tonight, making four changes, including in goal, Marcus Hanneman playing for just the third time this season. So thus, just one change tonight for Caleb Porter. Jose Valencia coming in for Rodney Wallace, who's away with Costa Rica. And I think Caleb Porter thinks about the uncertainty defensively for Seattle, the athleticism and speed of Valencia. Are indeed, Alexi, thank you so much. It is crunch time in Cascadia. The stakes have never been higher. It has never meant more when these two have met and they do meet for the 82nd time. Trying to make it a frustrating start for Dempsey, the Pacific Northwest, as Rosales kills us in. The flick, to oh, oh, and Dempsey and Nagel, in fact, producing a splendid save from Ricketts. Donovan Ricketts once again to the rescue. Well, and we talked about it in the open. How good has Donovan Ricketts been this season? He's won MLS Save of the Week nine times, and it's for plays like these. 2-2 draw against Vancouver. Oh, the header down. Almost paid off. Adam Moffitt with a little curl. Oh, on the crossbar! Denying Seattle and Clint Dempsey what would have been his first goal. Still they attack. It's a ferocious assault on the Timbers goal, which doesn't yield a reward for Seattle. It's been all over the place. This is a great ball in, in exactly what you want and where you want Clint Dempsey to be. I feel like too often in the first three or four games for Seattle, he's been trying to force the issue a little bit, drifting out wide. Clint Dempsey makes his money inside that 18. Oh, Hanneman started to come for the cross, changed his mind! Oh! Gives the Timbers the lead. The Seattle defense that have been so good for close to 45 minutes pays the ultimate penalty. And more pandemonium in Portland. Initially, you looked at this ball from Jewsbury and we thought Marcus Hahnemann was coming off. But that back line from Seattle is too deep. Look at how deep this back line is. Now it's all about defending for the second ball. Aruti, Valencia, Al Hassan, all wide open at the 18. That's an easy finish. And tactical decisions are just getting players a little bit more focused or finding that niche on the field against the opposing team. They've been great in the first 15 minutes of the second half. And they're starting off. It finds Fettel with the shot from Valencia. It's fizzing its way not far over the crossbar. And Hurtado's having a conversation right now with Alonzo and Moffitt because Darlington Nabby is tucked inside right in front of those two. And now it's opened up space in behind for Valencia and Alassane to make those runs in and cause some problems for Seattle. Most likely come down to a set piece. It's a hard player to take off if you make. Kasky's delivery! Oh, it was right there for the taking, wasn't it? John Kennedy Hurtado threw himself at it. Glancing, diving header, which flashed across the face of goal rather than at it. Magby picking it off. He lured Hurtado, Hurtado's challenge leaves Nagby on the ground. There's another follow-up challenge out of your picture between Alonso and Will Johnson. And, well, Caleb Porter saw Alonso perhaps lift an arm in the direction of Will Johnson's face. Could Ozzy Alonso be in some trouble here? Perhaps 65 minutes, 70 minutes. There's a red card out. I think I see a red card in the hands of Hilario Grajeda. I think Ozzy Alonso is gone. I haven't seen a clear signal yet. It is now. Seattle is seeing things unravel in spectacular fashion here. Down a goal and now down to 10 men. 
and it's not just Alonzo. Alonzo gets the red card, but immediately, Mauro Rosales is off the bench in the assistant referee's face. Clint Dempsey, Adam Moffitt. Seattle has completely lost control of this. My question is right now is where is the fourth official on the sideline? He is nowhere to be found. What's this warranting a red card, Taylor, for you? There's, there's, yeah. It's an elbow up there. Whether or not Will Johnson makes too much of it, Alonso has no reason to put himself in that situation. But then watch this. Nagel. Good shot work from Nagel. Oh, the shot! Requires the save from Ricketts. Zakawani can't keep it alive. Portland defense staying deep. Seattle build again. Off it over the top. Oh, it's there for the grabs! Oh, it's gotta be! Off the ball! Would you believe it? Zakuani saw his shot deflect up and onto the bar. How did that stay out? Well, the Timbers goal has led a charmed life at times tonight. Still Seattle press. Andy Rose trying to bulldoze his way through. Out comes Donovan Ricketts. Steve. And this is almost identical, Adrian, to how Portland scored at the end of the first half. Dump it in, look for a second ball. Yeah, right. Are you kidding me? Zakawani does everything right here. Look at Cobb, put his body on the line. And the spin off the turf hits the crossbar and comes out. It's feisty. It's all over. The Portland Timbers are top of the Western Conference.